the district race and coming off that first loss, trying to regroup and get ready back into the flow of things in terms of uh, close game, but the shootout. Was all right. That. Well, the kid, the kids handled it very well. We've had a great attitude and a great work ethic and a great week of practice. So the kids are the kids are ready to put it behind them and just get to work this week. What do you take away from the loss day? You know, we did a lot of really good things. I thought I, I thought our defense played with a lot of great effort. We just missed some tackles when we needed to make them, but our offense was very efficient, ran the ball when we needed to, almost 400 yards, which I don't think we've ever had that at Caprock High School. But I was very proud of how the kids played and responded, and we just didn't we didn't capitalize when we needed to. I know Mel Kess, the weather did play a little bit of a factor, just the ball being slippery. You might have that again tomorrow night. Right. Well, we, we got an old rubber PE football out there yesterday in the rain just to make sure we can hold on to it. But the weather is what it is. It's Amarillo. We can't control it, and it's going to change. But our kids are ready to go. They're not going to let it bother them. Randall, obviously, kind of in the same boat, needing a, needing a win in district, so it's another big one. Oh, yeah, and Randall's a whole lot better than what their record indicates. They're big up front. They're physical. Their defense does a good job flying around to the football. So. We've emphasized physicality this week of practice, so hopefully it pays dividends for us. You've thrown the ball a lot the last couple of years. I know the weather was a factor that day, but like you said, to have that many yards on the ground from two running backs, that's, that says a lot. Is, is that just a, you did it that night, or is that maybe a philosophy of change a little bit your offense? Well, we always want to try to be 50-50 or as close to it as we can, but you come into those games where there are just some factors that you can't you can't get away from, be it a defense or the weather or whatever, you got to be able to adapt. And our kids did an excellent job of just going out there and grinding it out when we needed to.